Does this picture reveal that there's going to be a grappling hook in Halo Infinite? Stay tuned throughout the whole video to understand all the details. How's it going everybody? It's Kevin here once again giving you a news informational video when it comes to Halo Infinite. If you like these news informational videos, please make sure to tap that like button so let me know you want to see some more content like this. And if you're new to the channel and want to update with all the news going on in the Halo community, make sure you tap subscribe guys, keep yourself up to date. So let's get right into the video here. So recently there was a so-called leak that happened about uh, Halo Infinite possibly having a grappling hook. There was an image that's circulating around the internet, people kind of speculating quite a bit about this. And uh, from the last podcast, we did bring this up, Pat and I did, and we had a decent little discussion about it. And watching, reading the comments on what you guys had to say in that video led me to believe I probably need to discuss this a little bit further, as in whether or not you can believe this grappling hook leak is possible. So back on December 8th, this image was posted, and it's been kind of circulating around the Halo community. As you can see, it just kind of looks like a picture of a TV screen or a monitor of some sort. Looks like a Halo 5 a, a sniper rifle with a, with a completely different UI and a very rudimentary uh, landscape on this image. The big uh, thing that people have been talking about with this image, if you look in the lower left hand corner, it says grappling hook. So basically this little leak has had the internet stirring around a little bit when it comes to possible game mechanics coming in Halo Infinite. Now how credible is this? We can't judge it. It just kind of surfaced on the internet. We saw this. It looks pretty close to like the real thing. Now, I know that there's obviously going to be a Halo 5 on PC. This could be some crazy ass mod that someone decided to kind of throw together or something, possibly. Um, I mean, we have no way to kind of judge the sources on this thing. And so it's you definitely have to take this with a grain of salt. But it could be an interesting thing to talk about when it comes to Halo Infinite. Could a grappling hook work in this game? It, I mean, from what I've seen uh, from the two trailers that we've had, especially on the first one, I definitely got this open world sense of uh, exploration, if you could, when it comes to Halo Infinite. as a very wide open landscape and it just can't seem to show a grand scale of things which is great this is exactly what halo needed but is that indicative of what the gameplay is going to be now i think an open world halo would be pretty sweet that's actually apparently rumored that that was the original idea when it came to halo uh, 5 but then that got scrapped last minute and we had a semi-open world halo game with odst so maybe we can probably fully flesh out that idea with halo infinite now obviously with the different kind of terrains that you would come across uh, we've definitely seen a lot of uh, uh, creational kind of platforms pop around when it comes to uh, Halo Infinite as we've seen on the box art and the recent Xbox Series X trailer as well that it could be some high elevation points that we would need to you know traverse and the grappling hook would be very beneficial for that now the thing is though is this going to be an ability that will come with you as you play the game is it like a equipment kind of thing like from Halo 3 obviously it's a lot of speculation to go involved with that Personally, I think having a grappling hook in, say, like the campaign side of things would be pretty awesome. Uh, just, uh, just a cool new game mechanic to kind of hopefully work out. Uh, someone in the comment section of my last video did bring up that isn't Chief a little too heavy for a grappling hook? Yes, he is a pretty hefty little boy. Uh, I would think a regular physics of a grappling hook wouldn't exactly work, but again, video games have been known to kind of bend the laws of physics for gameplay, and I would think they'd probably make that change as well. But of course, this isn't all you know going to be set in stone. This is going to be in the game. Uh, I mean, there's this probably one thing that we're just testing out, possibly in Halo Infinite, and seeing if it worked, if it was something fun, if they can make it work and play well in the game. Uh, there's plenty of things that have been left on the cutting room floor when it comes to Halo, especially in Halo 2. If you guys remember, uh, actually, that Halo 2 was originally going to have Sprint in that game. Uh, if you kind of held the joystick forward for a while, it would initiate Sprint. And it ended up just not being a good mechanic, and they scrapped it. Could be the same thing with a grappling hook in Halo Infinite. We don't know. But I just thought it would be kind of an interesting thing to bring up as, uh, you know, we are all very thirsty for our Halo Infinite news. Also on Reddit, there was this video that was posted kind of comparing the two together. As you can see, um, this is the left video is from the We Are 343 video that was recently posted up. And obviously people are going to be dissecting that down to the very, very minute details. And we can see some kind of rudimentary kind of gameplay that's happening right over there on the left side 
of the screen. Uh, it kind of looks like it used like a breakout UI on the uh, upper left hand corner of the screen as you can kind of see up here. Uh, similar kind of uh, health bar shield system that we have going on right here as well. And so, but then you can kind of tell, obviously, very rudimentary geometry. And it looks like, again, like the Halo 5 assault rifle. And it just, um, you know, just very, very basic kind of stuff. Again, is this going to be indicative of what's going to be in Halo Infinite? I don't know. And I don't even think 343 would know at that point if this is anything that you're going to see as a leak would actually make it into the game. Again, but this is just kind of some interesting things to look at. Obviously, they would reuse assets from Halo 5 just to have an item there, like a sniper rifle, an AR, a battle rifle, and then they'd probably, probably tweak it after that to kind of make it fit the game and rework those weapons as well. So how credible is this leak? Is it going to have a grappling hook? Are we going to have some crazy new modes going into the game? You never know. This all is unconfirmed stuff, but it's just kind of something to talk about and you want to see what your guys' opinion is when it comes to, I say, a grappling hook in Halo Infinite. Do you think it'd be a cool addition? Do you think it should be just a campaign thing or could it possibly work over in multiplayer? I mean, I know Titanfall 2 did that. Even with their crazy advanced movements, movements they even added in a grappling hook as well. Uh, so it'd be kind of interesting to see how that would play out. Personally, my thoughts, I'd like to keep that just in the campaign side of things and leave the multiplayer to be just like a true Halo experience, uh, what we've known and loved from the uh, previous games. And that's what I would like to see, but we'll see how uh, it works out. Maybe it will work out super well. Again, it's one of those gameplay mechanics that you can kind of work around to make it work really well. Obviously, like say, like if you had sprint and boost in Halo 3, probably wouldn't work out so well, but sprint and boost in Halo 5, to me, works out pretty well. So it all kind of depends how you develop your game around that. So if you guys like these kind of news informational videos, please make sure to tap that like button. So it lets me know you want to see some more content like this. Leave a comment down below with your thoughts on the grappling hook and the gameplay potentially that we saw in uh the trailers or the videos right there and if you're new to the channel stay updated with everything everything going on in the halo community make sure you tap subscribe people and if you miss any content from me check out the videos on the screen right now i'll catch you all in the next video peace out